Okay, let's talk about auto-tune in Adobe Audition. I get asked this a lot. Yes, it's possible. You can do it much better with plugins, but let me show you right now how I do something like this. First of all, I'm going to record a new audio file and I'll call it auto-tune. Hello, this is Mike and I'm singing in a weird way, but I hope that auto-tune in Audition will work. Okay, obviously, I can't sing, as you can probably tell. But what I can do is take this, I'm going to turn the volume up using my heads up display there, and then I'm going to go into my effects rack, and in the first slot I'm going to go to time and pitch. It's as simple as selecting automatic pitch correction, and then if you want to do that kind of typical auto-tune that everyone wants to get, you know, the kind of T-Pain, the very auto-tuned kind of thing, uh, just drop down the presets and go for extreme correction. Hello, this is Mike, and I'm singing in a weird way, but I hope that auto-tune in Audition will work. Uh, you can probably hear, particularly at the end, work. It's kind of warbling me. It's not the best auto-tune plugin. There are better out there. There's Antares auto-tune. Uh, there's uh, G-Snap, uh, which you can use on Audacity and Audition. Uh, there's one actually called Grillion 2 that I thought was quite good. That's got a basic free plugin, and you can pay for the upgrade as well. And uh, my favorite auto-tune plugin, uh, definitely 100% has to be Waves Tune. I just love it. It's so easy to use. But if you want to do audition auto tune you can do it if you want to get a more uh, kind of natural auto tune just bring down the attack and the sensitivity here if you want to like kind of mess about and try and get that warbling a le little less warbly i advise you to change the fft size don't change the cal calibration of your middle c unless you know what you're doing and you can select different keys so chromatic is a pretty good one if you don't know the key of the song you're working with but if you want to go for like say e major Hello, this is Mike, and I'm singing in a weird way, but I... And you can hear how it's tuning me to the key of E major there instead. So yeah, you can have some fun with this. It's much more helpful if the person that you're using auto-tune on can actually sing. Uh, but as you can see, it's very possible.